In uh, Marissa Meyer's early days at Google, she was a programmer, one among a few. But over time, she saw that what her real strength would be would be product management, where she would sort of organize a team to make sure that a product was great. And some of the products that she was responsible for were uh, Google Search and Gmail, uh, Google Search being the most important one at Google by far. She was in charge of making sure that Google Search worked really well and looked great for users. I think Marissa Meyer was a natural in product management. At Google, it was really just the engineers and maybe the CEO. And they really needed this middle layer where someone could organize the product engineers and designers around um, a game plan, goals. That is one of Mar Marissa Meyer's strengths. It always has been, even since she was a little girl and she was organizing the pom-pom team's routines. She was always the person who got the team to practice later, designed the routines, and got everyone just doing pointed in the right direction. Marissa Meyer's career stalled probably for three reasons. One was that she never really had um, the ambition to be a business leader at Google in the way some of her peers did. Some of her peers would go to meetings that would cover all of Google's business operations beyond their own products, whatever they worked on. Marissa Meyer would go to some of those, but she wouldn't always go to all of them. And, and, and she was more just laser focused on what she was charged with doing, which was making sure that Google search looked great. So she didn't have the right kind of ambitions. The second problem that Marissa Meyer had at Google is that she really needed to be the, she was in a role where everything that went live on Google, especially in its search products, had to go through her. She had to sign off on everything. And some people at Google over time felt that she really was slowing the process down. So one of them or two of them or a group of them, we've heard that you know one person did it or several people did, went to Larry Page and said, look, either she goes or we go. And Larry Page said, okay, we'll fix this, and then he moved her to a different product. The third reason that Marissa Meyer's career may have stalled is that for a time, she actually dated Larry Page, the CEO of Google. And some people can't help but wonder if it would just made for an awkward circumstance that the person that she used to date was now the CEO, could she really report to him?